A Valley family is speaking out tonight after a scary incident involving their teenage daughter. Now one minute she was asleep, the next her bed completely engulfed in flames. Team Charles Bianca Bono is in the alert center for us and Bianca, how did this happen? Well, Mark Caribe, it's unclear exactly what caused this fire, but it involves this teen's phone and her charger. Now she and her parents are warning others not to sleep with their phones in their beds. I woke up and I heard this like pop sound. It was just before seven o'clock in the morning in surprise. High schooler Faustina Feely abruptly waking up. She didn't know if what she saw was real or a nightmare. I looked down and I saw that there was flames. Her bed on fire. I heard Faustina in the hallway say, my bed's on fire. Her dad Jim springing into action. You can see the mattress you know, how, how it just consumed the mattress. He was able to put the fire out and thankfully no one got hurt. Once the chaos stopped though, they realized the popping sound that woke Faustina up came from her phone and phone charger. The case started melting. This, the aftermath. Her phone now dead and the third party phone charger she was using. It's like ripped in half too. Charred. It was white before. Yeah, it was white. As investigators work to determine the exact cause of the fire, Faustina and her family hoping this scary situation serves as a lesson for others who sleep with their phones. Put it like somewhere away from your bed. If she didn't wake up with that pop or that explosion, you know, sound, then, you know, she could have been burnt. And an Apple spokesperson saying the company encourages its users to use Apple accessories rather than those third party chargers. Guys, back over to you. All right, Bianca, thank you.